In the meantime, excitement over the state's vax a million drawing is growing in the Miami Valley after a Northmont student is the first to win a free college scholarship. Two News reporter Caroline Morse talked to people getting the shot for a chance to win. After the first round of winners were announced, I spoke with several Ohioans who say that they signed up to receive their dose just for an opportunity to win. It, did, it definitely influenced our decision to get it in the time frame that we got it. After seeing a Miami Valley teen win a full ride scholarship, the Maisie family says with twins in the family, they signed their children up to receive a dose just to have a shot at a free state college education. It would, it would be very nice. To, you know, to, to, like I said, having two in college at the same time is going to be pricey, so it'll be very nice to have one taken care of. So. Since the lottery was announced, the state is reporting a 94% increase in vaccinations among 16 to 17 year olds and roughly 50% among 18 to 40 year olds. Governor DeWine says the lottery was intended to create a sense of urgency among Ohioans. That the faster we can get people uh, vaccinated, the better it is. Because once someone is vaccinated and they reach their full, full immunity, not only won't they get it, but they're not going to spread it. Another teen says he received a dose to help life return to normal. Kind of hated being quarantined and having to wear a mask in general because I like seeing people, talking to people. People with, people with a mask is like completely different than what they look like without the mask. And when we get back to normal life, I think it's going to be a lot better because you can actually see people and talk to them and people will actually have to be in person. Now the next round of entries must be submitted by midnight on May 30th and the next winners announced on June 2nd. In Dayton, I'm Caroline Morse, 2 News working for you.